Hey everybody, Brand Swanson, not singing, along with Sean Anderson, not singing. No. And we are talking Los Angeles and Arizona here in this one. The Los Angeles Rams with a big win last week, and Arizona with a surprisingly awful day against the Buffalo Bills. Sean, what are you thinking in this one? Um, if you have children uh, and you don't want to hear them hear profanity, you might just want to mute the video for a little bit. What the fuck is going on in the NFC West? What the fuck is happening? The Seahawks don't look that great. I know they won last week, but they don't look that great, mostly because Russell Wilson's hurt. Arizona's 1-2, and two, and they fucking lost to Jimmy Garoppolo. I'm not that mad about that, but they also got blown the fuck out by the Bills, and the Rams have two wins. What the fuck is going on? Sean, is your family watching? I hope not. <laughs> I hope not. That's why I asked. Your parent, you can probably unmute the video now, so uh, welcome back here. <laughs> I don't understand what's going on with the NFC West here. The Rams have two wins. They don't look terrible. I mean, they beat the Seahawks, and they beat the Bucks. The Bucks isn't that big a win because the Bucks don't look that great either. But still, what is going on in the NFC West? Arizona, I mean, Carson Palmer doesn't look that great. He doesn't look like the Parson Palmer. Parson Palmer. Parson Calmer. Parson Calmer. Parson Calmer. Parson Calmer. He looks like Parson Calmer, not he Carson does. Palmer. Thank you. He looks like Parson Calmer, not Carson Palmer, with five touchdowns and four interceptions. They don't look that great. David Johnson's supposed to be the savior of this running game, but he doesn't look that great either. Maybe you throw in Chris Johnson there. I don't know. Probably not. That would be a bad move. But then the Rams here, I don't know how they're winning games. I don't know how they put up 37 points. Really, I could look at the stats, but I still want to understand it. They got Case- Todd Gurley going. Yeah, they did. They did. And that was really the key last week of getting Todd Gurley mm-hmm. going. And that's probably going to be the key for the Rams this week is to get Todd Gurley going again because Case Keenum, newsflash here, he sucks. He sucks. He can't drive the ball down the field. He doesn't have any weapons. He sucks. He's bad. He's not a good quarterback. If you want to win more games, probably don't have Case Keenum as your quarterback and probably get some wide receiver help. But that's probably not going to happen since we are already into the middle of the season here. You got Todd Gurley, one of the best running backs and one of the up and coming running backs in the NFL. Get him going. The Arizona Cardinals, wake up. Bruce Arians, you're supposed to be one of the best coaches. I think you were coach of the year last year, if I can, if my memory serves me correctly. Get your team going. Get this defense going. Wake them up. Get your offense going. Wake them up. The Arizona Cardinals were supposed to be the team that went to the Super Bowl, in my prediction. That wake team up, doesn't look... Wake up. Are we going to sing again? Yeah. Wake me up. Before you go, 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 don't leave me hanging on like the yo-yo. Wake up the Arizona Cardinals because I thought they were going to be the Super Bowl team from the NFC, and they don't look like that at all. I'm going to pick the Arizona Cardinals because I'm hoping they wake up, but if the Rams win this one, I won't be too surprised. I will take the Arizona Cardinals 35-17 to because they look like they'll keep bouncing back and forth up here, but if the Rams win, I wouldn't be completely shocked. Well, folks. Why am I so pissed off that was the a lot. West? That was a lot. That was a whole lot. So I'm sure you have plenty of comments down below. Make sure you comment down below in the comment section. And if you want to talk to Sean maybe one-on-one, you know, his Twitter is down in the description. Folks, if you like the video, make sure you like it. If you are all about MVP, make sure you subscribe if you have not. And, of course, if you want to help us out just a little bit more, become a patron at our Patreon page. And also, folks... Just wake up if you haven't already. And if this if this is the first video you're watching for the day, <laughs> holy shit. We'll see you next time. Peace.